Welcome to Plant Sugar Creek. Recently I had the pleasure to see the speech of Melanie Joy about carnism and she has been speaking about this for a long time now. I think I wrote a little uh, text on uh, my homepage about a year ago. But now she is in Denmark and have been having speeches in uh, Copenhagen and in Aarhus, maybe other cities as well. And it's a great opportunity to support the, the vegan movement um, to join a speech like that. So I did that and we had our mother with us. So that was interesting. <clears throat> and just to let you know what carnism is, it's, uh, it's when you don't have any your, all your values as a human or not all your values but many of your values as a humans are just you believe that it's okay to eat meat and consume animal products that is the carnism and one of the things is that you normally humans have empathy to other beings and that empathy um, and justice and authenticity when you have empathy you also have compassion and when you, when you you lack when you lack those things because you believe that it's okay to eat meat you need to use some defense mechanism and the mechanisms you can use is that it's it's natural to eat meat it's normal to eat meat and normal in the belief that most people actually eat meat so you know normal the curve is from statistics says that if you have the, the, the most people what they do it's normal so if the most people eat meat it's normal and it's okay and that's one of the defense mechanism you use in the carnism carnistic world or belief system so um, now it's pretty cool because now this normal thing will become like in a religion so you're a carnist so now people are saying okay, veganism is a religion. No, it's not. Like carnism is not a, a religion. It's just a, a just a belief system. So what you believe in. And also, the last thing you can say, you said we said it's uh, normal, it's natural, and it's necessary. Many people really believe that it's necessary to eat animal protein and then probably also animal fats. Um, so that's that's the defense mechanism you can use to to justify that you are you're eating meat and you're a carnist so what you can do is to make people think about what they're doing and maybe at some point they can see that it's uh, not the best way to do things it's actually wrong it's not it's not healthy and it's not necessary and it's it's, it's normal but it's at some point, I hope it, is, it will not be normal, it will be normal to eat plant foods. Like many other areas in, in the world, it's normal to eat plant foods. So, it's, uh, it's going to be, be interesting, especially when the word carnism will be get out there. So what you can do is, every other sentence you can use the word carnism. And people will be... We <laughs> will then find out what it really means. So, go carnism and spread the word about carnism and maybe we'll be able to make people to think about what they're actually doing how they how the industry and uh, all the things have have uh, have done to to people uh, and people don't think why don't people think about that some people you love and some people some animals you love and some animals you eat so that's a quite strong and interesting concept, don't you think?